At yan po ang ating nagbabagang balita samantala sa magandang Pilipinas sa atin namang alamin at kilalanin pa ang isa sa ating rehiyon sa bansa, ang Ilocos Region. The Ilocos Region lies on the northwestern coast of Luzon and is known for its historic sites, beaches, and the well-preserved Spanish colonial city of Vega. It consists of four provinces and eight cities, namely the province of Ilocos Norte, Ilocos Sur, La Union and Pangasinan, the cities of Batac, Lawag, Candon, Vigan, San Fernando, Alaminos, Dagupan, San Carlos, and Ordaneta. First in our list is La Union, otherwise known as the surfing capital of the north. It boasts its beautiful beaches, for instance, in Bawang and San Fernando. The province was created in March 2, 1850, out of towns then belonging to Ilocos Sur and Pangasinan. Luciano Almeda headed the provincial government for the time during the Philippine Revolution, while General Manuel Tino occupied San Fernando in May 1898. After the battle on November 19, 1899, the American troops took control of the province. In 1901, a civil government was established in La Union. A year later, La Union ceded a narrow strip of land to Amborayan, which later became a sub-province of the Old Mountain Province. Ilocanos dominate the population. Some Pangasinenses are found in the southern part of the province. A substantial part of Chinese Filipinos can be found in the province's commercial center. Ilocano is the predominant language of the people. The main sources of livelihood are farming and fishing. The principal products are rice, corn, tobacco, garlic, sugarcane, and cassava. Grapes are also grown extensively. Cottage industries include blanket weaving, basketry, shell craft, pottery, and furniture making. La Union is also well known for its basi, the native wine made from fermented sugarcane juice. Now let us go to my home province, Pangasinan, or the land of more than a hundred wonders. This is because the famous hundred islands can be found in Pangasinan. The third biggest province in the Philippines and it derived its name from salt or asin in the vernacular, owing to the rich and fine salt beds which were the prime source of livelihood for the province's coastal towns, Panag-Asinan or Pangasinan, which means where salt is made, came to be its name. Also known for its famous Bunuan Bangus, thus the birth of the Bangus Festival in 2002. It was initiated by then Mayor Benjamin Lim to promote the Gupan's most precious gem, Bangus or milk fish. Since then, the Gupan has been celebrating this festivity yearly in the month of April. Pangasinan is not only known for its bangus, but we also boast of the famous Puto ng Kalasyao, the Lingayan Baguong, and also one of the past Philippine president was from Pangasinan, and that's no other than Mr. President Fidel Ramos. Our next stop is Ilocos Sur. Sure, Ilocos Sur. Ilocos Sur was founded by the Spanish conquistador Juan de Salcedo in 1572. It was formed when the north, now Ilocos Norte, is split from the south, or Ilocos Sur. At that time, it included parts of Abra and the upper half of present-day La Union. Known for its historic town of Vigan, Vigan is known for its preserved Spanish colonial and Asian architecture. Calle Cresologo dominates the Mestizo district with its cobblestone streets, Malecon, horse-drawn carriages, and rustic mansions. When in Ilocos, people always want to try the famous longanisa. These pork sausages are the star at any Ilocano table. The sausages from Vigan are the most famous and they are distinctly small and plump. One of the oldest towns in the province of Ilocos North is Batac and was founded in 1587 by the Augustinians. The city is also famous for the Batak empanadas, which are considered some of the best in the country. As we can't get enough of Ilocos, we'll have more of Ilocos. Now let's get to know more about Ilocos Norte. It is a province of the Philippines located in the Ilocos region in Luzon. Its capital is Lawag City and is located at the northwest corner of Luzon Island, bordering Cagayan and Apayao to the east and Abra and Ilocos Sur to the south. 
Ilocos Norte faces the South China Sea to the west and the Luzon Strait to the north. Ilocos Norte is noted for being the birthplace of former President Ferdinand E. Marcos, who led an authoritarian rule over the country during the latter half of his incumbency. The Marcos has enjoyed a modicum of popularity in the province. Ilocos Norte is also known as a northern tourist destination, being the location of Port Ilocandia, an upper-class hotel, and beach resort famous among expatriates and pagutpot. Some of the famous foods in Ilocos Norte are bagnet, a Filipino dish consisting of pork belly, liempo boiled and deep fried until it is crispy. It is seasoned with garlic, black peppercorns, bay leaves, and salt. And the famous pakbet, which is made from mixed vegetables, sautéed in fish or shrimp sauce. The word is the contracted form of the Ilocano word pinakebet, meaning shrunk or shrimp. Ating natunghayan ang ganda ng Ilocos Region, muli niyo po kaming samahan bukas. Maraming salamat sa inyong pagtutok. Ito pong muli si Maureen Jill Quison para sa magandang balik.